Hello, my name is Talaya. I go to Colby Community College for the Vet Tech program. I'm here to give a speech on how to be successful in college, and this is the audience that I'm speaking to. The first thing is how to utilize your resources. Um, this is really important when you're not going to go to college alone and not knowing what you're doing or what to expect. Um, the student union building has all sorts of things that it has your financial aid, your student services, your admissions, and your counselors. Um, program advisors is what you choose to study in your program, or you can ask other advisors too. Your professors, which is your everyday classes, and your students that go to, that you go to college with. Applying to choose your career. Apply to as many colleges as you want because it, it will never hurt you. And if you decide that you want to go to this one college but then you don't, then you already apply to a different college that you may like. Visiting campuses. It's really important to take a tour of where you want to go because if you're not passionate about it, you're not going to have fun and you may not be successful. Cost of tuition is really important. If you're really can, um, concerned about how much it's going to cost to go to school, maybe you should look at the cost of tuition, um, choice of program, go where they have your program that you think you want to go into. Scholarship opportunities. Study hard now and it will make it easier in the future. Ask school counselors or college campus about scholarship opportunities. There's plenty of them out there. Some of the scholarship requirements is your GPA, academic involvement, extra activities, degree requirements. Um, your GPA is really important. It may not, you may not seem like it, but your high school GPA is really important. That's how some colleges accept you into their college. Academic is really important. Um, extra activities, FFA, um, 4-H, uh, any other thing that you can think of is really good because there means that you're getting out and involving your community. Degree requirements. What are your degree requirements for what you're going into? Types of scholarship. Valedictorian is a 4.0 throughout high school. Um, sports, basketball, cheerleading, volleyball, you name it, it's out there. Academic, 3.5. They'll give you scholarship for it. Grants is what you get that you don't have to pay back. Loans is what you have to pay back. And there's many more options. Financial aid is something that a lot of people, how they go to school. It's a government loan or grant that is giving, given to you. You fill out the application once a year, and it's by, by your parents' tax income until you're 25. And after that, I think you're on your own, but I'm not sure. Um, loans is what you pay off within six months after you graduate. Grants you don't have to pay back, as well as some scholarships. The difference between university and community college. University is um, a four-year degree program, has more resources, it's more for tuition, bigger school, bigger class sizes. Community college is a two-year degree program, less resources, less tuition, smaller schools, smaller class sizes. If you're unsure where to go, I would start, and what you want to do, I'd start the community college, get your generals done, it's cheaper, and then decide where you want to go after that and what you really want to go into. Instead of jumping into a university, not knowing what you want to do, still doing your generals, and then you just kind of wasted all that money. I've had experience with both, and I wish I would have started at a community college first, but I started at a university, and now that's kind of just... And if you start at a community college, make sure that your credits transfer. That is the most important thing. So if your credits don't transfer, they're going to transfer as electives, and then you wasted those credits. So make sure they're going to transfer code here. Um, save now is the biggest thing. A dollar a day can get you a long ways. If you don't save now, you're going to hurt in the end. Don't forget to ask for help. Apply early, take campus visit, and it's never too early to start thinking ahead. Are there any questions? Okay. Well, that's my speech, though. So.